This is the provocative invitation that led a group of pilgrims from Arizona to walk the Camino de Santiago and at the same time appear in the documentary Footprints, El Camino de Tu Vida. Se buscan personas dispuestas a caminar mil kilómetros durante 40 días. No se ofrecen garantías de llegar al destino, pero sí se prometen jornadas de sufrimiento intenso, con frío y calor en proporciones iguales. Las lesiones musculares y las ampollas son más que probables. El desaliento invitará a abortar el plan. Se dormirá poco, algunas noches sobre el duro suelo o en un saco bajo la lluvia. Eleven brave people with different backgrounds and personal stories agreed to the project without hesitation. Like all roads, eventually this one also came to an end, as they traveled from Santiago to Rome and discussed their journey while in the Eternal City. It was a great experience. Um, there's so much that you get out of a pilgrimage, and I'm just blessed to have that opportunity. The route is not easy, but it is something that they already knew. There were times when both physical and spiritual exhaustion had the best of them. The Spanish priest who now works in Arizona accompanied them as a means to ease their situation. Tenemos la edad psicológica del dolor que hemos sido capaces de superar. Y eso yo pues creo que también la peregrinación nos puede enseñar en el futuro también, eh, a no quedarnos a no dejarnos vencer por el por los momentos difíciles, sino superarlos. ¿Y cómo se super, superan con la esperanza? Footprints is the latest project of Juan Manuel Cotelo, director of La Última Cima and Mary's Land. With this film, he wants to show how the Camino de Santiago transforms the lives of the pilgrims who dare to undertake it. People get the opportunity to walk the Camino de Santiago in order to learn how to walk in life. It's like a study on life. When walking through different villages to get to Santiago, you will not just remember the photos or postcards or things you've eaten but you'll gain some very strong lessons for your everyday life, and that's mysterious, but it happens. This documentary will soon be streaming on Netflix. From start to finish, the film immerses the viewer with an action adventure. The whole movie was shot without a script and left everything to improvisation. Anything could go right or wrong. However, the director was confident that the pilgrim's journey would provide a plentitude of stories to tell at the end of their experience. The protagonist traveled over 500 miles in 40 days, and one of the most popular pilgrimages traveled by more than 200,000 visitors a year.